What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel, birds, and you enjoy my content, if you ring my bell and buy my soul tribe, I super duper appreciate it. Same, same, saying. This is um, week two, November 2021's reading for a sign of Virgo. This could resonate if you have Virgo in any aspects of your charts. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, Midheaven, or Jupiter. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. Doesn't apply that apply. Everyone has free will. If you enjoy my readings and you have, are not a subscriber, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. Just let you guys know. Thanks, everybody, for all the love and support to the channel. Like, subscribe, shares, dislikes, etc., etc., And all the donations. If you'd like to donate, type your sister 05. Links in the description box below. All right, you guys. Um, I got one channel to end as I was meditating on your... Um, Week, uh, week two's reading for energy for the sign of Virgo for November 2021. And the um, channel that I received was um, a Virgo is about to have someone come back into their life and attempt to keep them stuck. That's what I heard. So some kind of reconciliation energy is what I'm feeling. I heard they're going to attempt to come back into your life. So whoever this is, they were in your life in some shape, form, or fashion. But they're going to try to come back in. Um, and keep you stuck so keep you with them or around them or keep you from keep you energetically stuck so you know that could be blocking your money it could be blocking other emotional or educational or um manifestative type energy um they want to keep you stuck in some shape or fashion um I would say use your best discernment and logic and reasoning with these people. Um, if they're high vibrational, obviously they won't be keeping you stuck because you would grow and manifest together. So I feel for a lot of you guys, they're low vibrational energies. Um, but use your best intuition and just um, your intuition and logic. Obviously, they um, were not good for you in the past. And they're going to try to come back in and keep you stuck. So that could be in a mental prison. It could be financially. It could be emotionally. You have to plug this person or people in your life how they resonate. Certainly feels a low vibrational, low vibrational energy, but you have to plug them in, okay? Um, just saying, just saying. Ace of Cups upright, not not a once reverse. For some, it's an X of the past. One to apologize, but for very strategic reasons. For some, it was a it's a platonic connection of the past. They will lie and manipulate. Okay, a lot of reconciliation energy. A lot. Um, if this resonates with you, a lot. Um, so for some of you guys, it's the ex of the past. Um, I heard um, they're going to apologize to you. Um, but they're going to do it for strategic, sneaky, manipulative reasons. So use your best intuition and judgment. I feel it's a low vibrational energy, some kind of X energy. And for some, it is a, um, I heard a, um, person of the past, like a platonic person of the past. So not anybody you dated, not anybody you were sexually connected to, not a partner of the past. It's a platonic person. Sorry, I'm trying to figure out who that was. So, you know, it could be a past neighbor, past coworker, past business associate, past um, um, person you communicated with, a childhood friend, childhood person uh, you went to school or college with, um, somebody of the past, past family member that you don't sp haven't spoke to in 10 years, whoever this is. Um, but I heard they're going to um, strategically lie and manipulate you. So... Use your best intuition, logic, and judgment when dealing with this person, whether it's a person of the past um, you have dealt with in some shape, form, or fashion platonically, or an ex. Ace of Cups upright is the new is the person of the past coming back in, or your ex, and they want to keep you energetically stuck. But a lot of lies, manipulation, and emotional manipulation here. So you that's this energy. So you plug it in how that resonates, if that resonates for you. Here are messages you have on Virgo. A particular Virgo thought 
that a Farsan fan was going to come back to a workplace situation. It was make it was making this Virgo very happy, but it's not going to turn out this way. They're soon going to realize this. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates, if that resonates for you. Um, some kind of fire sign family in your past, if this resonates with you, I think you work with them. I think you I think you were co-working energy, or you could have been over them in some shape, form, or fashion, a manager, boss, supervisor, CEO, or worked in corporate, or a co-worker, or you could have been under them. However, that resonates, but you I feel you work with them. Um, because why else would you care that they were coming back? You know what I'm saying? Um but I heard you thought they were going to come back. So I think to the place you were currently working at, I heard it, it was going to make you very happy. So I think somebody told you they were going to come back or they were going to try to manipulate this person to come back or convince this person to come back. But I heard it's not going to turn out that way. It's actually going to turn out opposite. Um, and it sounds like it's going to make you sad when you find out they're not coming back because I heard it was going to make you happy when you found out they were going to come back. So you plug it in, however, that resonates, if that resonates for you. Four of Pentacles reversed, Nine of Wands upright. A Virgo is about to see huge changes in a fire signs spending. Some they have stolen money, some they're about to receive a huge increase in their income. Okay, so you plug in how it resonates, um, if this resonates with you. Um, so some kind of fire sign energy, it can be masculine or femme fire sign. They could have Aries, Leo, or Sag, and the Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, Node, Midhaven, or Jupiter. Some of these fire signs, they stole money, for some they it's a huge, uh, they're about to see a huge increase in their uh, financial situation. So it could be a raise, a promotion. It could be them taking on a side hustle or two side hustles, or like I said, getting a raise or a promotion or a bonus or something of that nature, or a new position that um, pays a lot better. However, that resonates. But um, I heard you're about to see this, you're about to see it manifest in 3D. So I heard there's about to be a huge change in their spending. But for some of these fire, excuse me, some of these fire signs they stole either from you or somebody you're connected connected to and for some it sounds like they did it the right way but you're about to see huge changes either way you're about to see huge changes in the spending whether it's the thief energy that stole from you or somebody you're connected to or the person that did it the correct way so four pinnacles reversed is not holding on to money the huge change in spending um but for the one that did it the right way it sounds like they're doing it the right way they just have a, a it sounds like I heard a huge change. So they're like I said, they either have two side hustles, three side hustles, two jobs, four jobs, three jobs and a side hustle, but they're really earning and manifesting their money. So they deserve to um, spend how they, you know, uh, earn, just saying. But for some, they stole the money. Um, but either way, you're about to see huge changes in this fire signs. Um, I think way they spend money, maybe they're going to wear out more. Maybe they... Uh, buy more expensive clothes, maybe they do home repairs, maybe they travel more, you plug it in how it resonates, but you are about to notice this in your world in some shape or fashion. You have to plug this fire sign in how they resonate for you. It's Aries Leo Sag. Um, they can have Aries Leo Sag in the Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North, Moon, and Jupiter. They're coming as a night energy. For some, they could actually be 18 to 35 S, or they just take on a very fun-loving, free-spirited, high energetic um energy um you plug it in how it resonates or they can be mentally immature for the thieves they could just be ment mentally immature for the ones that are not thieves and do it the right way they could just be have high energetic drive motivation and that sort of thing and they just have lots of desire drive and motivation to the world and they're about to be res uh, rewarded in the universe for it financially you plug it in how it resonates Spirit messages you have sign of Virgo.
Ten of Pentacles upright, Nine of Cups reversed. A particular Virgo is about to start saving a lot of money. Some addictions or quelching, some sex addictions, some alcoholism, some drugs. Well, this is a great one, Virgo. If this resonates for you, you go with your bad self. If this resonates with you, for some of you guys, um, you're quelching your addictions and some gambling. Okay, and some gambling. You're quoting your addictions in some shape, form, or fashion, which is causing you to save money. Um, for some, I've heard it's sex addictions. Uh, so maybe you um, spend money on prostitution or you spent money on some kind of paid pay site like OnlyFans or paid actually money for porn videos. You plug it in how it resonates. Um, for some, it was alcoholism. So you spent so much money on booze all the time. Um, and for some, um, drugs. So, um, you, and some gambling, but you're quoting the addiction. So you're either taking it one step at a time or you're going to like AA or NA or whatever that is. And it's helping you, um, or you're doing it yourself, however you're doing it, but you're, you're 10 of pentacles upright. So you're saving a lot of money doing this. Um, and then nine of cups reverse is not doing the addictions anymore. That's the partying hard card, um, uh, addiction card. So, um, your culture of the addiction, your, um, your, and which is causing you to save a lot of money and keeping your abundance up. Ten of Pentacles upright, positive ten, positive ten, best money card in a row, real girl. That's great. You can go with your bad self. All right, let me get a, um, some tea leaves and then we'll close it. Spirit messages you have, Sandra. A Capricorn thinks a Virgo is hot. Very sexually attracted to them. They will probably tell them soon. Oh, my Lord. Okay. Well, okay. Heard a um, Cavs thinks a Virgo is hot. Um, they're very sexually attracted to them, and they probably will tell... This Virgo soon. So they could have caps in their sun, moon, rising, Venus, or they may or Jupiter. Um, you plug it in how it resonates. Um, Capricorn energy strong. Um, they're very sexually attracted to you, masculine or femme. Um, you plug the caps in however they resonate in your life. Marriage and diamond. Marriage. A particular Virgo is about to get remarried for some they have just recently gotten married financial stability here okay so you plug it in how it resonates so for some of you guys you've recently got remarried i heard remarried and for some you're about to get married and that can be remarried or first time marriage you plug it in how it resonates but i heard lots of financial stability here so i think you realize this before you either got married or you're about to get married for some, you could be um, engaged right now or about to be engaged. So we have a marriage card. So some upcoming weddings, some you just got married. That could be courthouse or an actual wedding. You plug it in how it resonates. But you recognize with your own intuition that it um, brought lots of financial stability. I think that's why you do, agreed to do the marriage. Or you're about to agree to do the marriage. Diamond, you'll be receiving or giving a precious gift. And for a particular Virgo, an ex-wife is about to try to come back. Very heavily drug addic addicted. Okay, and you, ooh, you plug it in how it resonates. Ooh. And for some of you guys, I heard an ex-wife is going to try to come back soon. I heard they're very heavily drug, drug addicted. So, you know, you can have... You can have 10 ex-wives, you can have two ex-wives, you can have one ex-wife, but some kind of ex-wife energy. They're very heavily drug addicted, though, whether they've been, always been drug addicted or they are now. Apparently, they're going to be drug addicted when they try to come back. So, you plug it in, how it resonates, that is ex-wife energy. Diamonds, you'll be receiving or giving a precious gift.
A Virgo is about to mail out some stolen money to the person, to the person that it is theirs. Okay, so you plug it in how it resonates. I heard Virgo is about to mail out some stolen money to um, someone where it is theirs. So it sounds like you have some stolen money of someone's, um, someone or some people's, and you're about to mail it to them. Um, so I'm assuming you know their address, you know their information, and you're about to um, mail it to them is what it sounds like. You will be rewarded in the universe many ways for this. Know this. Okay, I heard you will be rewarded in the universe many ways for this. Know this. So apparently you returning this stolen money to person or people um, is going to reward you in the universe many ways for you returning this stolen money. Now, I don't know how you acquired this stolen money. That could resonate in a million different ways for million different people, but you recognize, one, it's not yours, and two, you know whose it is. So it sounds like you're about to return it. But, I, but it sounds like you're going to get universal justice in this because... Universe sees all. Spirit sees all. So they're going to see that you're going to do the right thing and return this money. And I heard basically you're, you'll be rewarded in a universe. Based, it sounds like 10 or 20 or 50 times fold for doing this. I think this is a universal gift, um, universal justice energy here um, because you're going to return the stolen money. You plug it in how it resonates. If that resonates for you. A Virgo is about to get a promotion. And a Virgo is about to find out they're about to have a new grandchild. Okay. Heard a Virgo is about to get a promotion and a Virgo is about to find out they're about to have a new grandchild. So um, that could be the precious gift energy too. Um, just saying, just saying. That's, that's beautiful. You plug it in how it resonates. All right, you guys. Well, we're done. I hope this helped real, real, real. Love you guys so much. If you think anyone else could benefit from these messages, please share these videos on your social media. I would very much appreciate it. Just saying. Brandon, BJ, Tracy. Brandon, BJ, Tracy. Okay, Brandon, BJ, and Tracy. Jessica. Jessica. Jennifer. Lewis. Jessica, Jennifer, and Lewis. So you plug that in, how that resonates. That could be your name, somebody you're connected to, name, first name, middle name, last name, nickname. It could be a name of a place, organization, or a business, or a street name. You plug it in, how it resonates. All right, you guys, I love you guys so much. Everybody make wonderful choices and namaste.